But here are the stars of the show. The eighth couple is Gabriela Papadakis. And Twice Gabriela world champions. Silver. Bitterly disappointing to be silver medalists in Helsinki. And they uh, bounce back in magnificent style in the short program here. They are the leaders by some way. Gabriela Papadakis, Guillaume Cizeron. Brilliant twizzles. circular step sequence that covers the entire rank. Mesmerizing. What a mood they created. The synchronization, fantastic. 
the timing well as near perfection as you could get and they've moved from Ed Sheeran to Beethoven in the blink of an eye Papadakis and Cizeron I'm blown away blown away by them I just there aren't enough positive adjectives to use for their utter magnificence I can't see how it can get much better sublime and <laughs> I've heard people critique the fact that this music choice is similar stylistically to that which they've used to garner their two world titles and world silver medal, but a friend of mine pointed out why we don't see Pavarotti changing to do hip-hop and rap. You know, we yeah. don't see Madonna doing opera. You have your genre, you have your style, and why change and veer from that? They have to change and veer from that in the given short dance rhythms of the year. So yes. this year, obviously, they're doing Latin, and we can acknowledge that that Latin theme isn't as suited to them as this. But I don't want to see them doing something that isn't what they're so brilliant at. I appreciate this stunning skating so, so much. And the program has developed. There have been changes since the Finlandia Trophy. That's where you had the stumble at the end of the step sequence. I think it went from a diagonal to midline. But these twizzles, just magnificent. And, you know, before this event, I thought Virtue and Moira were going to be a lock in. And now it's just, this has blown me away. Foot perfect. I don't even know now where the scores can go because the technical elements are surely all at virtual plus three grade of execution. I'm not sure whether or not the technical panel will give them level four for the step sequence. That's a, normally the the missing link for even virtually more and Papadakis and Cicero and step sequences tend to be awarded level three. They need a hundred percent clean turns to secure the level four so that's maybe something that will push their scores up. This was the choreographic spinning movement which wasn't just stunning but so so difficult. And this is comical, Roman Uganar, who's been working with him for a long time now. He living, breathing that performance, and that's what you need, that's what they need. They need a coach that's going to be entirely behind them, and they share the same coaching team as Virtue and Moore, but it definitely seems that on that coaching staff of Roman Uganar, Marie Franz de Bruyne, Patrice Lauzon, that Roman is the man that sticks behind them most. I think Marie Franz and Patrice are those that are behind Virtue and Moore a little bit more. It was a fabulous four minutes. <laughs> They're going to win. The question is, what score are they going to get? Best ever score. They've got 119.15. Well, that's the world record. So let's see. 119.15. They've beaten it by 18 hundredths of a mark. That is the new world record for the freeze game. They've wrapped it up at 200.43. That's a world record overall. Phenomenal skating and phenomenal marking for Gabriela Papadakis and Guillaume Cizeron. And they, of course, win the Cup of China.